morning everyone it's Sarah in here and welcome back to my channel or if you're a new viewer welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video so as you can see by the title I'm gonna be taking you along with me today for a day in my life at university if any of you guys are new I am a master's student at City University of London doing broadcast journalism and I make tons of videos of university in London recommendations around the city etc so if any of you guys are interested in that then definitely make sure to hit the subscribe button but yeah today is Thursday I'm actually only in for the afternoon which is really nice especially because yesterday I was literally in for like 10 hours I'm not even exaggerating so I definitely needed that break um, but I worked out this morning feeling good just got ready for the day and I am about to leave but as always before I do I'm gonna give you a quick outfit of the day so this is today's fit I've gone with a monochrome look um, my top and leather blazer are both from Zara these jeans actually thrifted whilst I was at the London College of Fashion which if anyone didn't know is where I did my undergrad um, bag is my new Goya which I bought in my last vlog if you guys want to see that and then trainers are these white chunky trainers from Shadavarius yeah today should be a fun day I cannot wait to take you all along with me um, and yeah without further ado let's get the day started <laughs> So we are now at uni and in our first radio class, we're about to do <laughs> like a mock broadcast. Um, we just got like a bit of an intro of how all of the equipment works. And I think we're about to do a read through. Um, yeah, we're getting a signal. I think we're about to go on air. So I'm going to pop you guys down. Good morning and welcome to City News. I am Morgan Burdick bringing you the news this morning. Fury and Deontay Wilder were denied a face-off last night. The World <laughs> Health Organization is hoping its direction will save hundreds of thousands of lives, mostly in Africa and mostly children. Good morning and welcome to City News. I am Morgan Burdick bringing you the news this morning. Uh, reading headlines today about council tax being set to rise. I think the jokes are wearing pretty thin. Tyson Fury and Deontay Wilder were denied a face off last night after a heated press conference before this weekend's heavyweight world boxing title clash. The World Health Organization is hoping its decision will save hundreds of thousands of lives, mostly in Africa and mostly in China. And then just click the link. Yeah, just click the link when you see And I don't know if you guys saw at the beginning of the clip, I had a white garden bag. You may be thinking, Darren, what did you get? Well, no, of course. It's actually Faruda who won at the 50,000 subscriber giveaway. We've just oh. finally given her her bag in real life. Basically, we wanted to meet in real life to give the bag versus me just posting it. And we're now in Shoreditch. 
Exactly. Exactly that. She's so amazing in person, and I'm really glad to met in person. Because I mean, it's different actually like, someone in like um, seeing them like on online and actually seeing you in person is like so real, and you're like so real in real life and online. It's like the same thing everywhere. It's like amazing. Don't let that cry. <laughs> And I'm so glad that I like, actually came afterwards and we met and like this is so so cool and I don't know she's just like, she's, like, she's an amazing person and oh my god yeah I was not expecting that thank you so much that's so kind wow thank you so much oh my god you're so welcome <gasps> dun, 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 dun. so much oh my god we love her we love her you can do a little you can put it over the shoulder <laughs> oh my god it suits you so much you do their hair and it's like a nice ritual for me so from very young i've always i'm very lucky maybe it's the being in nigeria that i never had any problems with my hair my earliest memory of like me and my hair was what I said about my hair being an accessory. I think it was, I don't know where it came from. Like my mum's. Like, 